good morning guys and welcome back to my channel my name is Donna this is my wonderland excuse the t-shirt on my head I have just washed my hair and had my shower um, completing my morning routine here on a Monday morning and today I am going to be tackling something that I should have done a month ago so I will get to that in a minute, but for now, I am going to eat my breakfast, have my cup of tea and watch a vlog from Smiley Citrus. Um, good way to start a Monday morning. Uh, my Mondays are a little bit relaxed um, because I tend to work at the weekend. I tend to have Mondays as my kind of slow day because I have a longer morning routine as well. I don't really kind of get started until late morning. So it always feels like a bit of a, a relaxed start to the week. So I'm going to eat my breakfast before it gets cold. I'm going to watch a vlog and then I will come back to you and share with you what we're going to be doing today. Finally. <music> Before I go and show you what we're doing today, just look at these cats. One on the box outside, <laughs> one inside. Look at Kitty's shadow on the floor. <laughs> Sun worshippers, the pair of them. Bless. Right, let's get going. Okay, guys, so before I show you what we're doing today, I'm going to insert a clip here of when this was all supposed to happen. Good morning. Okay, so this is confession time. We are on the 3rd of January. My goal was to have my office tidy and set up ready to go on the 3rd of January so that I could start the year fresh and really like jump in headfirst with a decluttered office. Yeah. And this is what I'm currently dealing with. Now that's Matthew's desk, so we ignore that anyway, but um, yeah, so that didn't quite go to plan. Um, the last couple of days I have been busy. I've been doing things. I've tidied. I've done different, different bits and bobs, but this just kept getting pushed back. So now I'm here. It is Tuesday morning and I wanted to work in here and there is just no room. So I am going to have a quick tidy up probably at lunchtime in here. Um, and then I'll have a real declutter at the weekend and get it ready for Monday morning. Okay, so you've kind of seen exactly what it is that we're doing today. So I am going to take you behind this door and show you how bad it's got since then. Um, I've literally been working at the dining room table for the last month and I want to get back in my office. That's the point is the office is the office and then you come out of it at night, you can close the door and you're off work when it's just there on the dining table. It's it's just too easy to go back to it. But before we do that, let's jump in to um, what on earth am I wearing? One is not a fashionista. Um, this jumper is my new jumper. I did a TikTok. Yes, I'm on TikTok. I'll insert the username around here if you want to come and follow me. Um, I prefer Instagram. I never intended to do TikTok, but, you know, peer pressure and all that. OK, so this is from Sheen. Never wanted to shop there either, but I really wanted to jump out. I won't explain it. You can go and watch the TikTok if you're that interested. Um, but I love this colour. The only thing is, is I wish it was a little bit longer. I wish it was a little bit long. No, OK. Um, so it's quite thin. Uh, it's got this nasty scratchy label that I'm going to have to cut out. Um, but I really love it, so I wanted to wear it. I am likely to have to go and change it because I am going to get a little bit hot. So even though it's quite thin and lightweight, I'm probably going to have to change at some point. However, the bottoms, they got pockets, guys. Um, these are the pyjama bottoms my mum got me for Christmas. And they are so super comfy and warm. And it is cold today, even though the sun's out. And the only other bottoms I've got that are comfortable are jogging bottoms or leggings and I didn't want to wear leggings with this short top because it's not got enough coverage for me and I didn't want to put jogging bottoms on again 
want something a bit different. So <laughs> I'm wearing this. I'm probably going to put a black vest top on, which is going to be a little bit more coordinated. But hey, it's Christmas colours, isn't it? And we've only just come out of Christmas. It doesn't feel like that today. It's a proper spring day, but it's cold. Um, so yeah, let me take you behind there. Procrastinating, aren't I? Let's go. Okay, we're going. I really don't want to show you what's behind this door. Okay, let me turn you around. Okay, guys, so this is Matthew's desk. This is what he's um, got to deal with. Um, that's his bag out of his car as well from when we took it for its MOT. But this mess I've got to deal with, cup of tea is ready to go. That's the third one of the day. My shelves aren't too bad, but I do need to go through all of that paperwork um, and throw some stuff out. I can put the cat carrier away because the cat stopped being sick now, but this, this is what I'm dealing with, guys. See, got my water ready. I'm a good girl. Um, yeah, those drawers need sorting. That pile down there needs sorting. That box there is stuff that came off of the window seat last year when I tidied it up that I haven't dealt with. So this is the mess that we're tackling today. Because I like having a big screen as well, so it'd be nice to have both screens again. So yeah. I guess we get started. I mean, I could go and watch some more videos and just procrastinate a bit longer, but I'm not gonna. Let's get to it. apology to my daughter um not actually from me because I didn't say it but uh we couldn't find this been looking for it for ages and Matthew goes it's probably in Terry's room and I was like yeah probably but you know we need a bigger one anyway this one only goes to three meters it is the tiniest my brother-in-law laughed at me when I bought this out to measure my garden because my garden's obviously longer than three meters and he was just like what's that He's a landscaper. Um, <laughs> so I've been wondering where it is. It was just sat there. It wasn't even buried. It was just sat there. Sorry, Terry. Okay. So I am putting all my paper and pens in here. There is a lot. And we have space on the desk, which is amazing. Getting echoey in here now. Um, I've emptied that box. Um, I've got to be ruthless now. That's this is the this is kind of the problem is that you can move stuff around the house as you declutter, and you've seen me go out a couple of times, and I've gone and put things in their place, which is good. I haven't just moved it to a different room to be cluttering that room, but I do have to get a bit ruthless now because. There's not a lot that I can throw away. I've got my paper box and pile down here that I'm gonna to have to go through because I don't need to keep everything. And it's just stuff, stuff that I need to throw away. And I struggle, I struggle guys. And I don't know about you, but when you've got something, when you've paid money for something or when you haven't yet used something fully, it just, it, right here about throwing it away so yeah I just don't even know I think I'm probably next challenge is to pull out all the drawer stuff um and get that up on top because I don't think there's a lot I can do with this just little bits little bits I hate little bits because what do you do with little bits you shove them in a drawer generally so um we'll empty the drawers pull out I think yeah I'm gonna process of elimination do the big stuff first so pull out all the drawers pull the paper and everything else and then then we'll get to the little stuff and what we actually really need to keep and what we just need to say Donna it's time to let go so drink my cup of tea because that's going cold and uh we'll get on with it
Okay, so that is drawer one empty. Just a lot of stuff. Like envelopes. I have got an abundance of envelopes. If anybody needs any envelopes, I'm your gal. Um, cleaned off the top of that. Um, again, I'm not just moving it. It's a big pile down there of paper that I've got to sort. Um, this box is now full again of the little bits, little bits of just stuff. Um, more little bits that could go in there actually. And yeah, got a little pile of stuff that needs to go in the craft room, stuff that needs to go in my bedroom. And did you see? So I bought myself a pack of really fancy pencils that were really, really expensive because I couldn't find the pencils my daughter bought me and I think these were it. And I bet you they were like two quid or something. <laughs> and mine cost me like 12, maybe more. They were expensive. But yeah, I found some pencils there, found more pencils, more colouring pencils on my desk. Just so much stuff. But I'm um, going to finish my cup of tea and then I'll work my way through the other two drawers. Then I'll come back and tell you how we're doing. I do not know how long we're going because my clock is on my phone. I know how long I have a watch. My Fitbit has broken. It doesn't work anymore. So I no longer know if I am working out enough. But there we go. Um, tea, two more drawers and I'll come back. Okay, so drawers are now empty and um, this is what we're working with. Pile here that I haven't actually gone through yet, hard drives and stuff that I can't throw away, a little portion of stuff that I need to go and find um, the things that need to go in there, box of stuff to sort through, stuff that needs to go up in my craft room, pile of wires, rubbish and three empty drawers that I now need to go and get the hoover that Matthew took upstairs for me at the weekend, bring it back down, hoover out the drawers, clean the drawers, and then see what is going back in the drawers because now I've taken everything out, there's not a lot I think that needs to go back in, which is good, we like empty drawers. More empty drawers the better I think, so let's get on with that. I just had a thought as I was putting the drawers back in and this one here actually has these metal guides that are supposed to be for like the files um you know the scoopy file things that you can file paperwork in that might actually be a really good idea because I do like to print out all of my um, worksheets and um course paperwork and things like that of courses that I do and it tends to just end up in that pile of paperwork and it's not filed away neatly now I do have some courses up there so I did B school and tribe and those were big courses so they've each got a folder but there's lots of little courses and things that I do and it might be really handy to get some wallets in here that I can actually put them in here that's a thought and then use this drawer for what it's actually meant for, which is just to keep your paperwork tidy. Um, I'm gonna think on that. I'm gonna put the rubbish in the bin and then I'm gonna see what needs to go back in the drawers. But <laughs> looking around, I'm like, um, <laughs> I don't know what was in them that could go back. Like everything else is going to a different place, I think. So we shall see. I might need some storage solutions in the drawers these little bits, the little bits that I want to keep that um, don't have a home, like my SD cards. I've got a little pocket. Um, let me see, can I find it quickly? I have this little pouch that has all my SD cards in, but then this pouch is just kind of floating. It'd be good if it had some a place to be, so a little box that it could go in. So. I have to think on some drawer storage solutions. Okay, it is getting on a bit now. I have emptied all the drawers I've put back in. Am I straight? I don't even know. Um, I've put back in what I want in there. Um, I've got a few more bits that I need to put back on here, but I'm going to clean now. Um, there's just so much to do. I haven't even tackled that side 
the printer and all of that jazz, it's not going to happen today because I have got other things I need to get on with. And what I am committing to is doing what I say I'm going to do in the time I say I'm going to do it. I do not have to finish. That is my new thing. So there is a great big pile of paperwork down there and all my pens and notebooks here, which I am going to go through, um, probably do a short or a something on it where I'm just going to check all the pens make sure that I'm only keeping what's working um throw away any I don't want go through the notepads see if they are useful to me but that's all stuff that takes a bit of time um and then I need to go through this unit here and the drawers and cupboards there and empty anything out there I'm going to try and clean off the top of the printer so at least I can see it and it's not buried, um, but I am going to clean this so that it is a working space again, clean that up and then I will tackle the other stuff another day because I just don't have time today. <laughs> because it got cold and um, it, <laughs> it was just because I was taking so long over deciding things I think I weren't moving around very fast after that first little bit so I got cold so I'm going to turn you around I'm going to show you what I've done um, we're just going to ignore from from there from from my desk back we're going to ignore it because I just haven't got the time or the patience for it today but I'm really pleased with what I've got done it's amazing how long it can take you to do one blinking room and this isn't even a proper it's two meters by three meters and all i've done is the desk area so um let's have a look so yeah ignore this ignore that Ta -da! oh my gosh it makes me so happy i absolutely love it when my desk is tidy look at that so i've got workbooks in not workbooks um, notebooks in there that I am going to start using um, so they probably won't stay in there so then I don't know what I'm going to use that magazine box for I've got my thank you cards in that white grayish box there um, and then I've got my little display I've got my two screens this is not um, an in-use screen but it sits there I've got my light for when I'm doing zooms and underneath is now tidy as well, which is great. Didn't get to this, um, but did do the drawers. So in the top drawer, we have got some bits and bobs, some bits of paper. Um, use Using this to keep these things tidy. Then you've got my little camera. I don't know what I'm going to do with that, to be honest with you. Mouse that I don't use. My cloths and my little sticky note things. And then in the next one down, I've got my wires in these boxes at the moment. They're not going to stay there. I've just got to figure out what they actually do. I know this one is for this pen and that is for my um, graphics tablet, which I'm probably going to sell on because I don't use it anymore. Hard drives, tape player, Walkman, anybody. OK, this is going to age me, but it'll also age some other people. I had an Alba Walkman once upon a time. And I've got cassette tape in there, so I thought, actually, there you go. I can listen to it if I get some batteries. So that's that one. And then go down here. And that is just the box that's got all the little bits that I need to work out what I'm doing with. So I've got to go through that and just um, find a home or get rid of the things that are in there. And then I can start using this look into how much it costs for the files that go across there so that is 
my desk. So happy. Okay guys, that is it for this declutter my desk with me video. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope it's inspired you to go and declutter an area of your home. Um, if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button and notification bell for more decluttering home fragrance and crafting videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps the channel out. All my days have I got a video for you on Sunday. I'm hoping hoping that I will have a little craft project finished and I am going to show you one that I did about two or three years ago and I'm going to show you what a beginner kind of crochet project looks like versus just a few years later what you can achieve. So if you've been following the crochet beginners series that I did this I hope will inspire you to continue practicing. Um, and if you are interested in home fragrance, I'll be back on Thursday. I'm gonna be going over all of the discontinued items. A lot is leaving the catalog this season. So if you are interested in Scentsy Home Fragrance, come back on Thursday for that video. And I hope that wherever I see you, that I will see you in another video very soon. Bye for now.